oh, 29 errors, unforced on the back of creating a lot of stuff and, and dominating position, but you just can't make that sort of uh, amount of errors and expect to have a positive outcome. Uh, the ball hit the ref's foot and uh, got called to play on and uh, they score another try, so that took the game away at the end. We came here to win and uh, you know that was the first priority and we've um, achieved that and we created enough opportunities probably at times to, to maybe um, secure a couple more tries but it wasn't to be. And we're every game behind in Cup is a dog fight and we're looking forward to having a race at home and we'll get stuck into it. People go on about uh, a change with the amount of injuries we've gone through and the amount of retired players but everyone that throws on the jersey wants to go out and uh, and enjoy special days like that. It was no different today. It's a, it's a massive honour to run out, and uh, anyone that does it uh, doesn't take it for granted. Knew coming into today that we were going to have to put in a big performance, and uh, um, thankfully now for uh, everyone's put in a serious amount of effort, and uh, we've qualified now, so it's uh, great news for the squad. You know, without putting too much pressure on the kid, he's genuine world class, and. Uh, he's a great finisher, but uh, as I said, you know, I thought the determination and the focus of our guys just to stick to their task, and um, and then the cracks started to open up, and we capitalised. And um, what happened on the inside of him to create those opportunities for him, it was uh, it was really pleasing to see, uh, you know, a lot of work that's going in starting to bear fruit.